What's up, what's up, what's up, everybody? My bad, I'm just sharing to uh, Instagram and Twitter and all that good jazz real quick. If you guys want to take a moment to go share, comment, like, you know, subscribe, all that good jazz, it's greatly appreciated. One moment, I got this IG to do now. IG, IG slash Facebook, I should say. Boom, live. All right, all right, we lit, we lit, we lit. Go ahead and pull the, the chat back up. We good to go. What up, Trey, Liz, Jasmine, uh, Diesel Field, Trey, uh, Holla Boy, everybody up in the beat. What's up? What up, uh, Jasmine? I have not seen you in forever. How have you been? Hopefully, you've been doing doing good. Uh, shout out to everybody that I feel like everybody else we be seeing on a regular basis. Liz, what's up? You know what I'm saying? It's been a couple lives since we've we've seen you. Hopefully, you've been good as well. But uh, yeah. We here, baby. We it's time to go down. What's up, Kayla? Let's go. Hell yeah. Everybody turned up and everybody hurt. You know what I'm saying? I, I tried to go live a little bit early today so that we could catch some of the people we've been missing throughout the last couple lives. Uh, but yeah, I don't want to waste y'all's time. We're gonna just jump right into this shit. You know what I'm saying? We're about to just jump. Oh, hell yeah, I feel you. I feel you on that, Jasmine. Just come hang out with us. You know what I'm saying? Come hang out with us. You know we always got good vibes for you. You know what I'm saying? The My High Mafia is here for you at all times. You dig what I'm saying? I don't know why I'm over here crib walking and shit. But uh, <laughs> uh, I love y'all. Let's jump into this, man. Let's give a big shout out to all the members. We got a couple of new ones, or actually one new one uh, from the last live. Uh, shout out to Jamal Moore, 770, the newest member to the Mahai Mafia. Uh, but let's go ahead and give a big shout out to the rest of them. Jamal, Jeffries, Holla Girl, Taylor, Funny Farm, Jordan, Christy Poe, Holla Boy, Marla, Marie, Diesel, Tammy, Nick, Creatively Insane, Carrie, Ryan, Nicole, Aaron, Mama Dukes, Misty Summers, Lynn Willow, Driver Thoughts, Lynn, Amy J, Doe, Liz, my Nugget, My Hood Life, and Gary Willis, Gang Gang. Shout out to everybody out there, you know what I'm saying? If y'all want to get a goddamn shout out, you want a personal shout out and all the videos the lives you want to take advantage of some perks and whatnot think about hitting that join button down below think about hitting that join button down below if you join i'm gonna shout you out i'm gonna I'm give you praise i'm a, you gonna get some discounts you gonna get emojis you gonna be a part of something amazing that's all i gotta say you know that's my pitch we got three different <laughs> options to choose from 2.99 499 and 999 so you could be a high member a really high member or the highest member your choice, you know what I'm saying? That's your prerogative. And then if that doesn't fit your fancy, just go ahead and do it the free 99 way. Yes, I said free 99. And hit that subscribe button, hit that bell notification, and join this good thing we got moving and grooving. Because we on our way to 100K. And we're going to hit there sometime today. Maybe not today, but with your help, we can. You know what I'm saying? So come on, do what you got to do. Subscribe, bell notification, gang, gang. Think about joining. Okay, enough of that. <laughs> Let's go ahead and jump into this, man. I was just feeling like doing some police stuff, bro. I want to see some... What up, Epic Services or uh, Misty? I wanted to see some people, I don't know, do arrested, do arrested, get arrested and be able to just talk some shit. You know what I'm saying? I've been having fun with that and I... I we God damn it, we're going to have some more fun today. Let's do it. I, I <laughs> I'm fucking amped today. I don't know why. Don't and stay like that. Okay? <laughs> Come on. No, no. Stay like that. Okay? Just get back in your position. Nine, no. Nine. Nine. I was like a whole ass car salesman, wasn't I? <laughs> Ooh. Okay. Hey. Hey. That shit right here. Ooh. 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 It's that shit right here. I like this. <laughs> this whole song is the shit. A good ass intro. Zero, you knew no return. Sorry? 
So she's just crashed in the middle of the street or what? What are you looking for? There's some slides right here. No, it's because there's some flights up here too, but I'm my so lost. Like, what the hell just happened? I just have one set. Right here, but it's great. Holy shit. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Um, do you remember everything that happened? Yeah, I'm okay. You're okay? Yeah, I'm okay. She doesn't sound drunk. Do you have a, is there a wallet in there? I'm sorry? Is there a wallet in there? Yeah, there's a wallet in the passenger seat. Or on my seat. What is it? No, I'm okay. Yeah, I'm okay. Will you do the 47 and I'll do the 45? What the fuck? Yes. I have like 10 reports. And I don't? No, we need help. <laughs> Where the fuck is her wallet? What, what the fuck happened? Like, obviously she crashed. Uh, yeah. Is she drunk? All right. Let's just get She's it just done. a distracted driver. We'll just get it done. <laughs> we're, we're tired. Yeah. <laughs> this is supposed to be shift change. You missed it. Though. Oh, no, you didn't. You were there, huh? What? She got pretty bad with you guys? Yes. She said she was trying to spit. No, she got a good, she got a good loogie out. She was like possessed, like rising up and then going back down. What the fuck is this chick talking about? No, this no, officer. we need transport. You guys keep getting out of it. Oh. Bruh, we're missing, we're lacking. What up, what up, Jeffries? What up, Nugget? What up, what up, what up, Holla Girl? Shout out to everybody up in here, bitch. <laughs> yeah, everybody, uh, yep, everybody go hit that like button. If you ain't hit that like button just just about yet, it ain't, you know what I'm saying? It don't cost you nothing. It don't cost you nothing to hit the like button, baby. You dig what I'm saying? Hit. The, okay, my bad. I'm just, I'm hype, okay? I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm not sorry. Hit that fucking like button. Okay, my bad. <laughs> Started 46. I just, just had, oh, okay. to, had to let it out, you know. I'm sorry. Do you have a coat in there I could grab for you? Oh. A coat? No, I'm okay. Is that his too? Uh, just pen underneath me, please. Like, can somebody explain what's going on? <laughs> Look, we've been just listening to the cop talk about how she don't want to go to do uh, do any more reports and shit. She sounds like super coherent hey, so and everything. Like, where are you, where are you guys is she from? like? I she don't sound home. drunk. From where? From El Paso, Texas. Where are you guys? Oh, is this the? What's that from? From El Paso. From where? Coffee. What is that? A uh, bar. Okay. So how much did you have to drink? Honestly, I do have three drinks. That was it. Who were they though? They were just vodka and crepe. Vodka okay. and creme? Hey, did you eat anything while you were there? I ate before when I had my first job. Okay. Yeah, that was it. Do you know what time you yeah. ate at? At, I want to say six. She doesn't even sound drunk, bro. What did you eat? Pizza. Do you know when your last drink was? Mm. 
I'm gonna be close. I wanna say like twelve thirty. You know what street you're on? Without looking. No, honestly, I don't really know my way around here. I just know how to get home. That's about it. Where do you live at? Um, on. Where'd you drop your buddy off at? I don't know where he lives, to be honest with you. He drove, yeah. So I, don't I was know where just he thinking, lives. Well, I want to run the SVSTs on you. You know, standardized, standardized build sobriety test. What's that? Well, <laughs> she she couldn't even get it out. The pen, walk the line. The I'm going to determine that. I'm okay, gonna that's fine. That. Where do you so want me to go? Are you? We can go to a flat service over here. Sounds good. Just so nobody's bothering you. Okay. Bruh. Do you feel like this is pretty flat? Yeah. He's out, Nugget. Okay. Nothing yet. You're going to space me? Have a good rest of the night, player. I want you to stare up. Put your arms on your side. I know it's cool. No, you're good. You're that's good. fine. Yeah. Actually. You're going to watch the top. See right here? With your eyes and your eyes only. I don't want your head to move. Okay? Just your eyes. You understand? Yeah. Do you have any questions? No. Okay. Look, her head is still. She ain't fucked up. I think it's safe to say. I think it's safe to say she got this one in the bag. I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna call it. Ace got this. She about to ace this shit. Let's go. Look at her head is she ain't moving not, not a lick. Them eyeballs is. She got that shit. Yeah, you ain't gonna trip her up. She ain't moving that shit, bro. Her head is staying rock solid still. Look at that. She is. She is a gangster for this one right now, bro. She's got it. She got it. Come on, put your hand down. Ace ain't moved. She ain't moved a lick, bruh. <clears throat> yeah, you trying to catch her up on some old bullshit. No <laughs> time. <laughs> no, you're okay. Just... Uh, okay. Um... Do you want to use this line as a reference? Uh, yeah, I, I call up in J line. <laughs> okay, what line do you want to use? You want it to doesn't use? matter. You tell me. Okay, place that left foot on the line that you choose. Okay. Okay, now I need to... Wait, wait, wait. No, no. Don't okay. start. Tell it. Tell it. You're going to place the left foot on the line. <laughs> Misty's like, she's kind of cute. You're going to place that right cute. foot oh, okay. in front of your left foot, touching Hilda Chow. They will and say she like failed. They, that, uh, you so ain't even lying, that. Ricky. Like they're going to... They right? go... Come on. Just based off this title... And it, like there, there's some bullshit about to happen. Some bullshit is about to happen. But she is, she's acing like these that. tests right now. Okay. Mm -hmm. so don't start until I tell you to start. When I do tell you to start, you're gonna take nine heel to toe steps. Get back in your position. Nine. Yeah. Ready? No. Right. Stay like that. Look at me. Don't look at anybody else. Okay. You need to pay attention. Mm -hmm. Okay. Stay like this. When I tell you to begin, not yet. I'm gonna show you first. Okay. When I tell you to begin, you're going to take nine heel to toe steps, keeping your arms down to your side, looking down at your foot and counting each step out loud so I can hear you. Okay. When you reach your ninth step, you're going to leave that front foot planted. You're going to take a small series of steps to return, return back to your line and take nine more heel to toe steps with your arms down to your side, looking down at your foot and counting each step out loud so I can hear you. Okay. Okay. I'm going to demonstrate three. So watch me so you know what to do. And then I'll tell you when to begin. Okay. okay. So you're like this. You're going to go. One, two, three. Leave that one planet. Small series of steps. Back on your back. line. You're going to go one, two, three, but you do nine. Okay. Do you have any questions? No. <laughs> yeah, fine. <laughs> Remember, arms down to your side. You're going to look down. You're going to count each step out loud, touching hill to toe. Okay. Okay? All right. Go ahead. Do you want to turn around? <laughs> oh, you fucked up. She said nine. Oh, she fucked up. Ace, why? Oh, she's doing them in increments of three. Bruh. Bruh.
<laughs> oh, man. And she explained this shit to her three fucking times, bro. Three times she explained this shit. She said, you need to walk nine heel to toe steps. Nine. Turn around and proceed to take nine steps back. But before you start, I'm going to show you an example using three steps. You will still take nine, but my example will only have three. Like, come on, bitch. You almost had it. Fuck. Okay, can I face me? So when I tell you to begin, I know you're called Tom for giving your arms because I know you're trying to keep yourself warm. When I tell you to begin, you're gonna pick whichever foot of your choice. You're gonna raise that foot approximately six inches off the ground, keeping your arms down to your side, keeping your foot parallel. Ooh, hold on. Okay. Just like this. Look down at your foot and count out like this. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, and so on. And so I tell you to stop. Do you understand? What are you gonna do? Okay, so that, right? Wait, wait, wait. Let me get my timer. Bro, she is like, she's so eager and so confident that she's gonna win <laughs> that she's losing. <laughs> this is like if she, if somebody was like, how many quarters is in a dollar, and she's like three, and says it with all the confidence in the world, like. Three quarters in a dollar. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's how I feel about her right now. Like, that's what she's doing. Oh, shit. Gang, gang, gang. We got another member up in the house. Shout out to Misty Summers. This is actually her husband's account. So, uh, Epic Services. Gang, gang, gang. Now we got two accounts out of the same house. This, that's two That's two families that's, that's doubled accounted it up. You know what I'm saying? Misty Summers and her husband, Epic Services. Gang, gang, gang. And we got Holla Boy and Holla Girl. You dig what I'm saying? Y'all better go get your grandmas, your aunties, your, grandma, your grandsons, your uh, granddaughters, your mama, your daddy, your, your aunties, your uncle. Make everybody join. Hit the join button for everybody, okay? All right. Back to this. <laughs> What's that? I don't know how you can see the screen. That's because it's the yeah, it's screen. Like that. You ready? Yeah. You ready? Yes, ma'am. Go ahead. Look down at your foot. Put your hands down to your sides. Look down at your foot. Count out loud so I can hear you. What the hell? She said, we do have seven kids. Hell yeah. Misty, all the kids accounts need to be membered up. <laughs> so go ahead and put your hands behind your back. You're under arrest. For custody and put to use today. Uh -huh. I'm going to put you in my unit. It's warmer. Okay, fine. You're going to be arrest placed under arrest for a DWI, okay? okay. I'm not going to put these tight as long as you don't try to slip them. Okay. Just glad to not have a feisty. Okay. There you go. Bruh, she thought, I swear, she was sitting there with that dollar. <laughs> she, <laughs> oh, bruh, she was so confident that she was going to win. In the very beginning with that pen test, that test is usually like the, the one test, like immediately you can tell off bat somebody's going to fail or not. And she like, she did so good with that damn pen test, keeping her eye, just moving her eyes and not moving her head. She, she aced that shit, bruh. She aced it. Okay? Every test after that, though, her, <laughs> she fucking failed miserably. Oh, she horribly point. failed all of them tests except for one. <laughs> Damn. You almost had it, Melissa. I think that's what her name was. You can get hurt worse. You ain't catching it now. <sighs> what up, Lynn Willow? This is what up, Carrie? Time. You ain't that late. You only we only just started like 15 minutes ago. This is brand new. The first one in it. Okay. It's my first one. W O I. Oh, okay. Kill me. I don't think you have anything on you. No, I don't. Man. Okay. No, I'm okay. 
So if I can get this done fast. Tried, it, it just it just kind of dawned on me. Like I'm sitting here listening. She's like, look, it's brand new. You're the first one to sit in the back. She like trying to make it all nice. Like, look, you're the first one to christen this goddamn you're the first person to sit your arrested ass on these seats. Like, ain't that special? Like, no, bitch, that ain't special. This is my first DWI. Like, fuck you mean. <laughs> we got all these firsts going yeah, around here and whatnot. Yeah, you should see you guys this afternoon. If not, um, they usually see you guys pretty fast, too. Okay, because I have a flight to catch tomorrow. My tomorrow? Sister's yeah, oh, what time? My sister's birthday's tomorrow, and I'm trying to surprise you tomorrow. I know, but what time is your flight? At 4. Oh, p.m.? Yes, ma'am. Oh, hopefully I think you should be good. Yeah, okay. Can we just see your mouth real quick? Open it. She just said 6 in the morning. Oh, oh spit out. She just said six in the morning, and now it's four in the afternoon. I'll have him bring your phone and your purse with you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. How you crash like that on a non-busy street? Like what the fuck? What were you doing? The machine's working, right? Remember? Yeah, Arjiak is, uh, Felina's just did a, did a 47. Okay. Oh, I'll do that. And then I'll meet you over there, because once you're 98 with, uh, her, the breath test, yes. I'll come on out and get her, uh, Oh, yeah, fuck. Okay. <laughs> she got hella shit to do. She trying to get off her shift. She is eight for central. And route to eighty one west is by fifteen. Hey Nanyas, can you bring her backpack? Can you bring her backpack? Because she has a flight tomorrow in the afternoon in case she gets out in time. She's going to have to get it from the station. Really? Yeah, because they won't take it at the D.C. Okay. It'll probably be easier to get it from the tow, tow yard. Okay. Yeah, because the D.C. won't accept that. Uh, that I'm not even going to bring her purse for that reason. Okay. Yeah, so. No. I don't think it'll cost anything. I'm going to do it. Yeah, I don't think it's going to cost her nothing to get her stuff out. It'll cost her some money to get the car out, though. Oh, my God. Really? I know. That's why I was just trying to... He's going to be very upset with you. You like how she like tried to sleep? She tried to like squeeze that in there like, yeah, my dad's a border patrol agent. You know what I'm saying? Like that was gonna make her do anything other than like, damn, really? Oh, that sucks. He's gonna be real upset with you, ain't he? <laughs> she just, damn. <laughs> eight for eight, nine, three, one, go to three. Yeah, we could probably watch some scary videos too after this. Down three. Are you ten six? Negative. Hey, can you eighty seven at the eighty one west? I only have the key for the east. I'm trying to pin Thank you. Hey, for I'm ninety eight on scene, so I'm gonna route to you. Awesome. Nine through one. Um, correct. Um, bro, they be having, <laughs> they be you having fun. They be bored as shit on them, my other radio. Ten four. Out. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> like. <laughs> Does he work out of here? Like, uh, oh shoot! That's where, that's where I'm oh shoot! You should have made the boy drive. You should have made that guy drive you. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Well, you should have stayed your ass tonight. Or called an Uber, bitch. They got Ubers and Lyfts. For a reason. Mm -hmm. Crazy. money you just wasted on that flight too and now you gotta call whoever was supposed to pick your ass up from the airport you gotta call them and be like hey so yeah i had to cancel that flight when she meets up with us at the hospital and come back over here we'll take you to the jail all right Shut the door. Shut the door. That's cold, huh? So we're gonna go into this back passenger. What up, Eric? A, a shitty situation that she's got to deal with. I know you said on scene that you're fine, but we have to bring you. That's fine. <laughs> this is Clear a shitty confinement. situation for old girl. I just brought him a patient from she was she was gone. Really? <laughs> she really gone now. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. He said she was gone. Oh good, she needed it, man. <laughs> yeah, that much? Going to school for her? Went to school. No, nah, her her dad is a oh, okay. her dad's a border that. patrol agent, oh, and she Don't thought that she was gonna me. slip that into the conversation, like that was gonna get her ass out of jail. <laughs> she tried to slip it out there, like he's a border patrol agent. 
I have it's a flight a tomorrow to go see him, surprise him for my Just sister's for birthday. This time. Like, you, nah, sir. you should have, you should have. We'll see you, hopefully not tonight. <laughs> You should have just not dri been driving drunk, lady. That's all it would have took was for you to not drive drunk. You would have been catching your flight. You've been catching your flight tomorrow. No problem. I'm like, blame her. She never got me here because of me or because of her. Y'all got to see me. So, uh, we in? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, this night's been full of crashes. We just got dispatched to another one. Yeah, there's been... You were the first one of the night. Control the any unit that can go tonight for another 45 in District 2. Damn, Damn. another one. Two? Another crash. Copy, it's 971. It's going to be Madrid and Solana, Madrid and Solana. <laughs> what is going on? What is in the alcohol in this in this fucking place? Is there a holiday? Is it, what, what is the deal? Why is everybody crashing their shit? <laughs> yeah, it's a pretty crazy little town, unfortunately. Yeah, unfortunately. Drugs taking over. <sighs> Makes people do crazy things. Bruh. <laughs> cool. Thank you. Uh -huh. it. No problem. This is, this is crazy. She said she's going to hit the bumper. Jordan, okay, glad you're up. So. But once I drop, well, I mean, I drove us home, and I tried to get her to stay in the guest bedroom, and she was insisting on driving home, and she definitely towed her fucking car and just got a message for her. Got a good answer. I shit you not. I will, I'll send you a picture of the car. But dude, yeah, like, I, I figured I'd contact you because, you know, your dad knows her dad, and, like, I'm, like, the most direct line of contact, but, yeah, the car is... Oh, like, shit. <laughs> They called somebody to be like, yo, <laughs> you know what's going down, bro? I don't know what you hit, but if she hit the front, she hit her hard enough, I had to crack the windshield, too. The bump is completely off the car, the fucking, uh, the driver front wheel is just completely mangled. But um, like, they were surprised that she was like, okay, how can you? She called you when you came yeah. over here? So basically, yeah, basically, we were on the way back from, uh, from the, the club. Um, we had met people at the club that went to the after party, we went to the after party, and that wasn't like a thing. I guess they didn't want to have it anymore. I was with my friends, and she was with her one friend. Okay. She dropped her one friend off and was going home alone. I offered to go with her because I was nervous, and she made me nervous enough to drive home. So I had her pull over, and I drove us home. Okay. I got her into the house, like in the garage, yeah. close, close, and I was like, look, we have a guest bedroom where you can come sleep, like get up six feet. And she's like, no, it's fine. And I like, climbed back to the front from like past on the back. And I was like, wait, this isn't smart. And she's like, it's fine. I'm like, that's fine. So she crashed. She called you and told her that she Yes. And right after she crashed, she was like, dude, I hit, I hit my bumper. That's all she said. She said that there were some homeless people out here and that they were going to call the police and that she just hit a bumper. So I was hoping it was like a minor fender bender. Because they were made me nervous was leaving the neighborhood. She almost hit a trash can. And that's why I was like, it's not worth it. But, and you're yeah. her friend? Hmm? You're her friend? Just yes. Friend? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is like even crazy like this is our, our third time like ever hanging out no okay so yeah you're really not no not really so she's the first person <laughs> oh yeah. man and, like so she just dropped me off well, what I, up, I, dropped myself off. She yeah. dropped me. I dropped myself off like 10 minutes or 20 minutes ago now okay hey, can you see yeah okay Not really like but well, she'll see a judge tomorrow. But then they have till midnight to release her? Right. For for she she's she's saying she has a flight tomorrow. Yeah. Oh, for a she's she's like, she ain't gonna make it. If it's through Muni, she doesn't see a judge till eight. And the process to get him out is not till like two or three in the afternoon. Oh, okay. Bro, yeah, she ain't making that flight. Yeah, she ain't making that flight. 
<laughs> Shit, Ricky didn't have to throw nobody under the bus. You know what I'm saying? Or not? Uh, yeah, he didn't have to throw nobody under the bus. Shit, she threw herself under the bus, crashing into some shit. Driving drunk. I didn't get it. Yeah. You know this time I have it. Yeah, I'll get it. You know her phone number, bro? Hey, Jordan, do you have this phone number? Can you send it to me? Just yeah. do I use the, yeah, the person who's the guy first took to me as owner? Yeah. yeah. And the driver? Yeah, because yeah. 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 you're trying to take the report. Yeah, that's the one I found. Right. What's your friend's name again? Uh, Melissa, the one Melissa? that... Melissa? Yeah, I got arrested. Yeah. What's okay. her number? I think the bumper leads to the problems. Yeah, it's not. It's not going back. Yeah, that totally... It's, it's fine, yeah. Yeah. That, that, that front corner panel is fucking bad. Now, is it drivable? Yeah. I mean, you could get it back on the road and have it, like, have straight body panels, but... Insurance sees that, it's fucked. She had the train? I, did she? Looks like she hit the tree. Yeah, that's yeah. yeah. <laughs> he said, "Damn, dude." Did she? Are oh, you have it? I'm yeah. surprised that she's not hurt either, that's, man. The the, the air you know, uh, airbags deployed and everything. Well, that's, all, that's all she did. She just called you and told you to hit my bumper, and I was like, <laughs> "Yeah, I guess I sort of to go." She literally just called me and said that she'd hit her bumper. There were some homeless people who were gonna call the, the cops, mm -hmm. and she was freaking out. She the ambulance was right on the way. I don't know what she was referring to, but yeah. Okay. Thank like, you. Yeah. So, um, I don't know. Anything else? I guess yeah. Anything else? This is. Fuck. All right. Well, Damn. Hmm? Photographic. Okay. Gonna make it easier instead of just trying to write it. a lot better. Yeah. Than I didn't. Let me go get my camera. Yeah. Bruh. Look, boy is just walking away now. Yeah, it's still about the same girl. This is back at the car. That was the car that she crashed. That was the that was the car that she crashed. And she when I mean she crashed it, she crashed it. Like she the windshield was completely obliterated. <laughs> like she she destroyed that car. Uh yeah, it's 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 not coming back. Like, you know, like the old boy said, somebody could put some straight body panels on it and shit, but it ain't ever gonna drive straight. Like, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like it's gonna forever have a gangsta lean and shit. You know? It's just gonna be one of them gangsta leaning cars because that's all that that's that's all it's gonna be good for. Uh <laughs> Hey, let's watch this one too, real quick. So this one's kind of a weird. I haven't watched this one. one. Um, I clicked on it. We were. I was gonna start this one off, or start the video off with this one, the live off with this one, uh, and then decided to go with that other one. So, but we're gonna do this one real quick, and then maybe we'll watch some scary shit to to finish it off. I'm just this this cop should be so funny, bro. Like just to see people and what they be doing and getting themselves into is 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 wow. But all right, man gets rear ended and then turns minor incident into a bizarre standoff. Got it from the Santa Rosa Sheriff's Office in Florida. In January, a man got rear ended in a very minor fender bender, but he decided to leave the scene. Police in the area responding to the incident spotted the truck that the other driver said was the truck he hit and proceeded to pull him over into the parking lot. That's where this part of it starts. And as always, the police report is in the description below. Wait, wait, back. wait, wait, hold, hold up, hold up, hold up. <laughs> so somebody bumped into this dude? And he just said fuck it and left. Why do I need to stop because you hit me? If I don't give a fuck, why do I like why do you care? Like <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Some of the case at the end of the video. <laughs> Somebody rear ended you? Yes, sir. I was trying to do a little U turn and I think he was on his phone. And, uh, That's what he said, yeah. He had called earlier or whatever. I just went back over there and got what there, so I was trying to contact y'all. <laughs> You're okay, man. Do you have your, uh, yes, yeah, yeah, you're good. Sorry that happened to you, man. You're just trying to go shopping and stuff, huh? Go <laughs> take a shower. Oh, really? Where are you living at? Drunk right now. Man, I hate that. Yeah. Uh, I know you got, uh, Tom Sawyer. You used to live on Tom Sawyer or whatever? I oh, no, you're fine. You're fine. Yeah. You need 32. You need 32. Yeah, 10-4. Isn't this the same subject you served yesterday? Here you are, man. Your license is good and up to date and all that jazz. Um, you just had what it. it is is FHP works for Rex and stuff, so that's not a big deal. They'll come out and uh, 
with this being your truck and stuff, you probably got insurance and all that jazz, all that good stuff. Yeah. They'll just want to talk to you too. Um, if you usually when people get rear-ended, it's the other vehicle that's at fault. Right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. So that's not a problem. Um, what they'll do is they'll just come out and talk to you and stuff. Uh, do you have a good phone number for you and everything? So in Florida, you have to, you have to talk to, to the... Uh, oh, were you? Yeah. What's up? What you the need? Man. Where I was going, where did you go? For what? You got my name. Oh, oh, is it like registry or something like that? No, no. What? No. Oh, okay. Who contacted you? Do you know? Who, who contacted you? Who, who did you need contact. to talk to? I, I was just looking for y'all's office. For oh. You. Yeah. Oh, okay. I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. Give me one second. I'm so confused. He's here. Yeah, you got him. He was looking for here, your office here. for probation. Yeah. Keep, keep an eye on him right now. This is... Uh, the temp dvi and stuff that uh, carlson took the initial but that's what's going on with him he was baker acted friday night mm -hmm. then when he got out carlson went over there and met him at the hospital and went and served the temp dvi mm -hmm. so he's wanting to come up here to see our substation so I'm sure it's something about that mm -hmm. but hopefully we'll make sure he ain't got no weapons and stuff like that Better. um what did you need to come up to the office for what was that about Oh, oh, about yeah. this? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, our office is right up there, yeah. man, and stuff. Yeah. Anyways, you don't have any... 32. 32. Is there any weapons in the car or anything like that? Okay. No, what I'll do is uh, let me get in contact with FHP as well so I can relay that to them. Um, I don't think they've gotten out here yet. Yeah, you said you saw him again up there, but there was no cop up there or anything. Then that means they haven't gotten here yet. Um, let's see. What do you do for What do you do for work? What What do you do for work? Oh yeah. Like, what do you got to be to get in a fender bender? You already have like police contact on a regular basis. Like, <laughs> man, that was like suck, bro. house construction like, you or just something. Can't catch a break. Oh, okay. How long you been doing that? Uh, a lot, a lot, really? I got you. Has it always been independent, or did you work for contractors out here and stuff? Yeah, I bought most of the ten dollars stuff. I got gotcha. you. Yeah, a lot of times I know insurance companies and stuff. Do you have an LLC or anything like that? Oh, I did. Yeah, I did. Oh, you did? I was going that's where the bread and butter is, man. If you get the LLC and stuff, then you can do your own contracting yeah. and everything yeah. else. Yeah. But you from this area? No. no. Okay. You got a lighter? I see a lighter in there. Okay. Yeah, go ahead and look, man. Yeah. There's no weapons and stuff, so that's good. Cool. the dash, but just leave it there. Uh, what you been up to, man? Yeah, 32. Not much. 32. FHP, what it is, is Florida Highway Patrol, they do all accidents and stuff. The problem is, is they cover the whole region. So there could be somebody in the bar that set it up here, or somebody in Pensacola, you see what I'm saying? Takes them a minute to get here. Hey, if you need to go in here and do shopping or anything, <laughs> if you gotta go to the bathroom or anything like that, man, you're good. I, I know you are and everything, I know we're here. I'm just standing by for them, you're good. Um, oh yeah, you're good, you're good. No, I was just gonna say, cause we're just standing by to stand by, you know how it is. Um, no, yeah, I saw Munt. He's doing really good. That's good. Uh, he seems happy. So, I guess they're looking at a pay raise here, potentially, or something. What's the deal with that? So, by the end of this month, they're supposed to enact a new pay scale. And basically, they're getting... What kind of fucking shit is this? We over here like listening to a pay raise and shit? shit? It's supposed to be starting out at like somewhere around 52, almost 53,000. And then every every other year after that, they get a 6% increase step for six cycles. By the end of that, they put them at what, 12 years. By the end of that 12 years, just a regular patrolman or trooper is making like $75,000. 
And they're saying that's guaranteed. Yes. They've already, See, the that's... governor's already signed off on it and everything. I wish I got guaranteed raises. Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> He's like, yep. <laughs> Like, yeah, your tail light got busted. If you use red tape, man, you can fix that. And then you got, uh, I don't know if you know about it, Butler's, you pull it. You know what I'm talking about? B Butler's is, uh, they have, like, towed cars and stuff there. You can actually go out on the lot, and if you find another Ford Ranger like this, you can just pull the light and pay for it there. It's a lot less expensive. You know what I mean? You can just get a used one. Because you know the, the bowls probably still work, but the rain's gonna get to it, it's gonna ruin it, man. That's what happens. You got uh, you got family here and stuff too? Okay. This would be so awkward. You, and you bro. said you I had you have, one, you have your phone. Did you need to call anybody or anything like that? Okay. Because your car's still running. You're right, they just so sit there talking about raises and shit, trying to make All we have to do is just get them to do the accident. Oh, hey. But like I said, with the way you were going and then with them. <laughs> Bro. Yeah, I was gonna say most people when you get rid of it, you're solid on that. Um all I can suggest is in the future if that ever happens, pull over. Shout out to, and shout out to Jamal, man. He's he he's the newest member besides uh Epic Services, who is Misty Summers, who's been a member for a long time. But Jamal is the official newest member of the channel, if y'all didn't know. I shouted him out uh, in the beginning of this live along with everybody else in the uh, membership situation. So shout out to you, Jamal. Appreciate you hitting that joint button, man. Talk to the other people, because sometimes they'll hash it out and say, no, no, I'll take care of it. Especially if they're at fault, you know what I mean? Do you want to go down there and sit right here? Yeah, that's fine. Or do you want to go to where they're at, at the accident? You'd rather go to the sheriff's office? Yeah, I can follow you over there. Hey, he wants to relocate over to the sheriff's office. You want to follow them over there? They're just Wait, like. Right. We're just waiting for FHP. So, he's not detained. Huh? He's not detained. No. Why, why didn't she stay? Why didn't he stay? Yeah, that's my question. Uh, I better than that road here. Then I said, well, I'll just go to a motel. And then I come back and I see him still sitting there. I turn around and uh, you're, in a, you're part of the you left the scene. I came back. No bueno. Uh, right. I came back and I seen this guy. So I just pulled in here and he made contact. You know, and I just went to the sheriff's office. Okay. Yeah, what? I mean, because parked here is just the same as anywhere else. Yeah. Um, I think yeah. it just ain't died, man. Yeah, let's go down to the sheriff's office. I ain't right? No, 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 you're perfectly fine. Do you want to go, do you want to go right there, there, the parking lot over there? Yes. Yeah, that's fine. I can let FHP know and stuff. Yeah, uh, no yeah I can come oh, over I, there. Yeah. I can come over there with you and make sure you're okay. All right, yeah. Why? I am so fucking wrong, bro. So as you can see, for some reason, he decided he wanted to move locations. And while he was on the way, he suddenly stopped in the road and did a U-turn. The officers interpreted this as him trying to flee. So they activated their sirens to pull him over again. Now, as you heard in the previous part, this man was Baker acted yesterday, which means he was involuntarily committed to a mental hospital the other day. So the officers are probably thinking something is up right now because he's acting pretty odd. The problem I've got, and I'm trying, I'm trying to help you. All right, what it is is you came back to where the the, the accident was. You know, you're trying to get amends for that. Bro, you got rear-ended, so... so everything kind of deviates. <laughs> what the, is hey, this dude doing? I don't know, but it seems like the other one was at fault. All right. The other thing is, if you leave the scene of an accident, that could be committing a crime. So technically, you did, but you didn't, because you're right here. You know what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? So I'm trying to make amends with that, but then I have the other agency that's involved. FHP, so I'm trying to correlate with them. They're just taking forever to get here, but when they get here, then I can get that taken care of. You see what I'm saying? I don't want to see you in trouble because if you leave the scene and stuff, yeah, 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 yeah. Come back up there and give him my insurance. 
Well, yeah, but it's it's the point now. It's like, hey, let's let's just stand by. We'll we'll stand by for FHP. You're perfectly fine. I've already checked. You have insurance and all that stuff. You're good. But like I said, let let FHP do what FHP has to do. Does that make sense? Yeah. Any, I mean, Bro. whether we wait here, or we wait there, doesn't matter. But I'd rather just not go back over there where they are because I don't want to see them be upset at you. You see what I'm saying? And and from what you're explaining, you were trying to do a U-turn. You got rear-ended. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> you're okay, man. You're okay. <laughs> how, uh, how long have you lived in the area here your whole life? Or did you just... Huh? Sorry, you almost four years. Where were you living at before? Uh, we walked. Bro, this shit is so wild. I've heard that. Before. What is going on? Yeah, this is they the call most it confusing yeah, 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 yeah. shit ever. Okay. Buddy has got like seven. No, we talking to the complainant yes. over there. We're just gonna have him come over here. Seven. But we're gonna make sure that we maintain so that they don't yell at you or get upset. I don't time. think they are because I talked to him earlier. He seems like a nice kid. He just—I don't think he's paying attention. You know what I mean? He seems like a younger guy. Uh, and you know how people are with cell phones and stuff nowadays. Good Lord. We always have problems with that. But that way, yeah, you guys can both be hearing, and then we can have FHP and give all the information and stuff. That, that'll that work. I just don't want to see you get in trouble for leaving a scene when you're not really. Does, does that make sense? You know what I mean? <laughs> I appreciate it, man. We'll, we'll stay with you and make sure that they don't, like, get mean with you or anything like that. Moy, and that's our canine guy. It's uh, what's his name? What? Yeah, I forget his last yeah, name all the time. Yeah. I know. How do you say your last name again? Yeah. 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 Kessinger. I wanted to say Killinger for some reason. I know. Kessinger. Anyways, the only reason we're here is because we help. We do like first aid. We come and first respond, whatever. Yeah. But we liaison with other agencies. So. And I don't, the only reason that I'm trying to maintain you is I don't want to see you in trouble. If you leave, it's leaving the scene of a crime. No, no, he's coming over here. So there's no need for that. But these are all our uh, radio numbers and stuff. Okay. Yeah, well, it's a, it's a radio number. It's the same thing. Basically, if you say unit 32, that's me. 130, that's Moy. And that's uh, Kissinger. That's, that's how we do those. Does that make sense? <laughs> we have a no. we don't have an actual batch no. number. We have He's a radio at... number. Which delineates who we are. Basically it's the same thing. It's the same thing, but that's what we use here. In like New York and stuff, they have badge numbers and stuff. Because you actually get issued a badge with the, the number and stuff. Which I'm surprised we don't do that. We have permanent ID numbers, we can do the same thing. They don't do that. I don't know. It's just the way the state is. Uh why but, is he, bro is just yeah, having all of these like, fucking no. I'm sorry you're having to deal with all this, but yeah, if you would have stopped right there, what would have happened is I would have went over and talked to you, I would talk to them. I've like learned random shit from this cop. Like I learned that, I, I forgot the department, but somebody was getting some big ass raises and shit. And you know, they were starting at, starting off at 52 to 53,000 a year. And every year for the next six years or some shit, uh, they were going to get, or no, next 12 years. They were gonna get consistent raises that were guaranteed, like six percent. And go that way, mama. Go shut the door. Uh, like six percent, and then at the end of the, all of that, it was gonna be like a total of seventy-five thousand dollars. You know what I'm saying? We learned that. We learned that Florida or wherever. I'm pretty sure it's somewhere in Florida. They don't do badge numbers. They just have radio numbers. But essentially, it's the same thing as a badge number, though. You know what I'm saying? Uh, technically, you can't leave a, a, a fender bender, even if the fender bender was caused by the person behind you. Um, even if you didn't really care, uh, you, that's now you left a scene of a crime, and now you've committed a crime. I didn't know that, you know? Uh, yeah, bro. Like, <laughs> what the fuck? fuck is going on, man? And then I said, hey, you guys have to maintain here until FHP gets here. <laughs> right. You wouldn't be able to leave. But I know you had to do some stuff or whatever. You came back. So here we are. I just want to maintain the same thing. 
if you end up leaving here, it's considered Bro, leaving the scene of, a, of an accident. That. Said that, like, That's a chargeable seven. offense. Right, so if I go to him, I can put the in the Yeah, and he's coming here now. So, yeah, we can, we can deal with that as well. Huh? What's that? That's fine. Okay, okay. Yeah. And like I said, I'm just trying to help you out, man. All right? I, I know it seems ominous, but seriously, I'm just trying to help you. Have you seen this truck before? I'm, I'm all, but uh, yeah, I'll put stickers on it. If you want to, um, you can keep talking too and just make sure, hey, you're staying away and stuff. You remember that paperwork I gave you yesterday? But... He said, I don't want okay. to. Unfortunately, the Florida Highway Patrol does not have body cams, but the troopers arrived on scene and through his interaction with James, he determined that he needs to be arrested for fleeing an accident. <laughs> What? Right hand. Is it a razor blade? Or a screw dip? Right hand. Is it yellow? Yeah. It's a knife. I took it off the dash. Hey, he's got hey. his hand on a knife. Back on that right hand. Back up. Alright. Bruh. Hey, what are you doing? Oh, he, he cut his throat. He cut his fucking oh, throat. Shit. Hey, man, drop the knife. Drop the knife right now. Drop the knife. Hey, I'm Crossfire. Watch out, watch out. Hey, put your hands up, man. You're going to get sprayed. Put your hands up. Get out the car. Hey. Get out the car. What the hell? What just happened, bro? This was Step out of the vehicle, wild. man. You know how it goes. Come out of the how did, we go, how did we go from it? <laughs> Holy shit. Now this goes back to that whole situation with the whole little Baker Act thing. His ass definitely should have been in the uh the 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 the, the funny house for a little bit longer than just a day. They sh they should have kept this nigga for a, a hot little minute. Like what the hell? Buddy did what? What what possessed Buddy to slit his own throat while he was sitting at the traffic stop waiting for people? <laughs> wow. That was like left field, bro. I don't even know <laughs> what happened. Why? Drop like, the knife. The hey, Fuzzy, get your spikes. Take the window. Take the window. Get out of the vehicle right now! Get out of the vehicle! Now they're about to put a truck in front of me. Get out of the vehicle! Hey, move your car up behind him! Come out of the vehicle, man. Yeah. Come out of the vehicle. This is only making things worse. Hi, James. Yeah, yeah, we will be sleeping through. James, this is only making matters worse. Okay. Whatever happened, don't worry about that. Okay. Let's worry about what's going on right now. Okay. Step out of the vehicle. I've got water all the way in the back of my truck. A big gallon jug. James, we can talk about this. You got cover? You got cover? Okay. We need you to step out of the vehicle. I need you to drop the knife. We were trying to resolve this peacefully. You understand that, right? So I need you to drop the knife, and I need you to step out, James. I don't want to hurt you, and I don't want you to get hurt. Okay? I need you to step out. Yeah, he most definitely does, funny fun. They said in the beginning of this. They said in the beginning of this, like, that uh, he had, for like two days prior to this, had been arrested and sent to a uh, a uh, mental institute or hospital for one day on the Baker's Act. But it should have been longer than that. Like, I don't know how, I don't know how old buddy got out in one day like i'm i'm i just i it doesn't make any sense like for him to get out in one day and then turn around and do this shit this just watch your cross you got that 
Yeah, I was going to say, if you want to move this right, way. Right, I feel you on that one, watch your crossfire, man. <laughs> you are not yeah. saying nothing but a fact. <clears throat> James. I've talked to you this whole time. I'm Sergeant Fuser. I've talked to you for a while. It's a harmless accident, man. Okay? Unfortunately, you... Look, James, you left the scene because you were scared. But unfortunately, that in and of itself is a crime. So let's get that taken care of, man. Can you do that for me, James? Bro, this is crazy. James, I need you to step out for us. We got some more of the pepper spray? More does. Let me get this. Let me get my let me get my less lethal shotgun. You can try spraying them again. Yeah, I can do it again. Yeah, just make sure the window's busted out. You got a good angle. Let the guys know. Go with less lethal. You got that fog, or you can just. You got the fogger? Oh shit, yeah. Give me that. Rip it open. Where is that thing do? Going to. shift report we're not even he wasn't even talking to him it was me a trooper and two milton pd officers to stand in there talking waiting for him to be cleared um he requested to speak to the two milton guys and have me and the yeah, trooper step really out shotgun, yeah. like, well, that they're not your thing you're not their prisoners wild. we're gonna stay in here the so the trooper just started like what's going on man what, what, what do you want to talk about and he that's basically it as soon as he said that i hit my camera and started recording everything um we pretty much just stopped everything right there. <laughs> and it wasn't even a, it, the, the question posed from the trooper was like, what do you want to talk about? What's going on? That, that's it. Because he was working the traffic crash side with his charges. So he has nothing to do with it. So <laughs> he did not, I asked him if he wanted to talk to a detective. And at first he said no. And then he was like, you know what? Yeah, I do. Uh, we're still at the hospital. Um, the doctor's going to um, probably just super glue where he tried to cut his throat and everything and then um, discharge. So I don't know how long we're going to be here. While a lot of that phone call you just saw was redacted, I've been able to piece together what happened through court records. While James was sitting in the hospital bed, he suddenly blurted out that he attempted to molest a little girl. This resulted in a six-month-long investigation, and in June of 2022, James was arrested on a few felony counts for the incident. For this fender bender and standoff incident that happened in January, what? James was placed under arrest, and 10 days later, the prosecutors filed charges. 
one misdemeanor for leaving the scene of a crash involving damage, and then six felony charges for assault on an officer. James was given an $8,000 bond, but has been shit. unable to post it and has been sitting in jail since. Now, something I want to note on this video is I think the original responding Bro. officer was extremely patient, and he definitely seemed to care about James. I'm curious what you guys think about that, and if you enjoyed the video, please consider subscribing as I post videos like this. That, <laughs> that was the craziest shit ever. Like, it went from just the most, like, what is going on situation, like, why, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, what is this, why is this even relevant? Like, this is boring to, like, holy shit, like, where is he going? You <laughs> know, why is he, why is he acting weird? To, oh, shit, he did what? And then it was like, oh, shit, he's sitting in the hospital screaming crazy shit out. And then it comes out that they've investigated and the shit's true. Like, <laughs> bro. That was like a plot twist and a half. It was like plot twist, plot twist, plot twist, plot twist. It was just hella plot twists. I just, I, I, my brain just went to mush trying to understand what the fuck was going on. And then we get to the end of that and it was just like, bro, why even try? There's, no, there's nothing to even try to understand at this point. That dude just needs to be in jail. And then we just going to call that or at a sane asylum, padded room, whatever. How, wherever you think he needs to be, that's where the fuck he needs to be. Not on public streets, though. <laughs> like, holy shit. That was, that was nuts. Like, I just don't, I don't even understand how or, or, or why, you know? It just, it just doesn't, third time this month, this guy hands a cop his crack. Oh, shit, we gotta watch this. In April 2021, <laughs> Delray Beach police officers on regular patrol stopped to talk to a local man they regularly give tickets to. After a brief conversation, the man pulled out a used crack pipe from his pocket and gave it to the officers. Now, interestingly, this is the third time this man has been ticketed for drug paraphernalia in the month of April 2021. And in all three times, the police report mentions that he approached the officers and voluntarily gave up the paraphernalia. As always, I'll go over the outcome of the case at the end, and the police report is in the description. So is this like, that's like his cry for help. Like, I need to get off this shit. I need, I need off this crack. This crack. I need off the crack. The crack is ruining my life. <laughs> Here, officer, take the crack. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Uh, hold on, hold on. Let Put me it in my hand. I'm 10-12. Oh, God. Can't hit it. See, I was fourth and upright. I haven't been smoking out of it. It's just something I hold on to. But... Well, it's been smoked out. You know I have to give you a court date if you have a stem on you. Um, What? I know. Did he just toss but, uh, a pipe I'm into, going a into a fucking halfway house today. This was the last. I didn't. The last rock? No, I didn't buy a rock today. No rock, right? No. Look, I wasn't yeah, lying. He's trying to get off the back. I had a stem on me because I have a tendency to hold on to, to, to bad habits. But once the halfway house uh, uh, um, is established down in Pompano, I'm done. Absolutely done. Okay. Well, our main concern is I want to see you stay clean. You're very nice. You're very honest. You're upfront about it. Thank yeah, you. I mean, if you so can't walk up when to are cops and hand in the crack pipes, I mean, um, <laughs> there ain't nothing you can you say about his honesty. This um, nigga's too right honest. Right like, <laughs> fuck? Okay. His name's Zoe. Okay. Is he a trustworthy guy? They're not somebody trying to steal something from you, nothing like that, no, right? No, he's a trustworthy guy, one of the most trustworthy I've met here. I only can trust like one or two people. Okay, and you're telling you're not telling anybody you got you got whatever you whatever money you got, right? No, 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 I'm keeping that a secret. Okay, good. Because uh, I don't want to see. You, yeah, exactly. I don't want to see that happen to you. Either. When you get to uh, halfway <laughs> or whatever, you appreciate you, your court days. I know you have <laughs> maybe one or two now. Okay. Yeah. So I want you to take care of those. You can't, you can't wait. skip them. Yeah, and you can't be walking around with a stem in your hand or in your pocket, wherever you have it. Right, right, I understand. Okay, appreciate the honesty, bud. It was just a habit, force of habit. Mm -hmm. But I'm, I, I promise you, this is, what I tell you is, is true. Um, <laughs> I swear on my grave. Okay, uh, you don't need to swear to me. You don't need oh, to put that man. on you. But, uh, I just want to see you do the right thing. I ain't got no, I ain't buy no crack today. No rock today. I ain't get no rock Where today. Where are you coming from right now? There's not a chair today. over there. I promise you, not about today. It. Yesterday, I, I, I bought some rock yesterday. Wait till. Oh, the little couch chair that that's back there? Yeah. Okay. 
What about the other day? You were hanging out on the chair on the front of this house right here. Yeah, most definitely. He um, definitely yeah, yeah, because, gentlemen, I, I, I let him borrow my phone, and my uh, care, my parents' caregiver came to get it back. The reason why I let him borrow my He's phone He's going to get it, though. Like, the halfway house, most halfway houses have, like, we have programs because they... Uh, return. I let him hold on to my they want, phone. They, like halfway house, you want to like set so you up. So then my like, caregiver had to come. You don't usually, usually hear too much bad stuff about the halfway the houses back. too much. So he's got the phone right now. You can make it to house. those situations. You, 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 you got to pretty good shot. I mean, not all of them are good, obviously, okay. but you know, so I'm going into the most most halfway houses. You know, you you got a better shot than than not. We have no choice because we have evidence. It's on camera, so yeah, we we have to put it in the evidence and we have to punch a case number for it. Uh huh. So it it's not something we can't just. Gang, gang, gang. Shout out to uh, Lynn Willow. She just upgraded her membership to a really high member. She ain't just a high member no more. She a really high member. She said, I can't just be a high member. <laughs> I'm too high for that. I gotta be a really high member. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Lynn Willow for that. Gang, gang, gang. We, can, we have to put it into our evidence and we have to document it. I so, understand. So everything's on camera these days. Everything's recorded. So we have to do everything by the book. I understand. Well, at least I'm going to have a roof over my head. Absolutely. <laughs> so you Buddy's got such a good spirit, bro. I love his heart, man. He says, shit, it's cool, bro. I'm at least I'm going to have a roof tonight. Shit, you know what I'm saying? You're going to take my ass in? That's cool. I'm about to have three hots in a cot tonight, motherfucker. Shit, I'm about to eat and have a fucking place to sleep. You ain't said nothing but a word. <laughs> Hey, nice my high is the best. I've been a sub over three years. So proud to be a member of 100K. Here we come. Gang shit. Yeah, shout out to Lynn. You ain't even lying. Shout out to Lynn, man. Shout out to everybody who's been rocking with me, man. If you if you new here, please hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell notification and help us hit 100K. Because we on our way. And we trying to hit that shit sometime today. You know what I'm saying? Hell yeah, let's go. Once you get clean and you yeah, have some stock, to. you've been working or what? How do you get all the cuts in your hands? I sleep in the woods and, and it just sticks just just keep me alive and the bugs and everything. They eat me alive. Buddy's got such a good heart, man. Well, at least you won't have to do that His anymore. spirit is just the recovery house. Yeah. Absolutely. It's just like a good spirit. I don't think bro. you should be he that bad. Eat. I mean if you're in the recovery house. A nice home, person who just got it's absolutely a, a bad yeah. habit. <laughs> you know what I'm a terrible you habit. You were clean for how long now? He yeah, got that for crack for habit. Years. Exactly. That's not so a good habit. You, you can do it again. Yeah, I know. I have, I know the ropes. Mm -hmm. And um, how old are you? Super can? strong though. Sixty-one. <laughs> <laughs> he probably yeah. super and, uh, strong when, though. You can collect social security. He's probably no? real fast too. Got ready. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So I, you have I, an I, income coming in. You have a little bit no, of money you, saved up you know now. What? You can get yourself clean mm -hmm. and. He got a plan, man. Exactly. You just gotta, you just gotta wish the best for people. Instead of sleeping in the, in the in the in the forest and, and smoking crack, right? I can guarantee you that dude no, don't want nobody really. to feel bad for him. You know what I'm saying? He do enough of that shit on his own. Exactly. You gotta just laugh. Yeah, funny after that. I made the uh, have been damaging my. Uh, I have kidney disease. Ooh. Crack damages the kidneys, so I gotta get that checked out as soon as. Today I get it get on like dialysis or something. Uh, I hope it didn't. It hasn't escalated to that. I corrected it. Now I probably got it back down to stage four, which is serious. Oh, no, you're I'm all good, Lynn. I, yeah. I say Lynn I know, and Lynn Willow. I'm not gonna specify y'all too. Yeah, otherwise you're gonna have to be sitting on dialysis for four hours a day. Yeah. So you don't wanna you don't wanna do that. Another thing, I, I've been having chest pains too. Do you need China. any kind of medical attention today or no? No, no, everything's uh, not happening. None of that's happening today. Okay. Because I've been doing good. Oh, that's good. All right, Kenneth. Same thing. I'm going to let you keep this pen this time. Um, your name is going to be right there, Kenneth Ruff. You're just being charged with the stem again for right. having it. Right. Just try to not have, don't be done with it. After this, right. you're done with it. That's crazy. I mean, like he said, you gotta do it by the book. You, you have a little cut on your hand, and we don't want to spread anything in the car. Like. 
<laughs> Here you Just go, a officer. Right there. Take this crap pipe from me. Gotta do it by the book. They gotta write your ass that citation, man. That little ticket. And then date it. And then date it for me today is April 29th. So 4 29 21. Keep the pen. Liz, come on, man. No. Can we look up when other Today at 8.30. Oh, oh, can it? Love. Okay, so. Go to the courthouse now. I will. If, well, you have. You're going to miss it. I don't know what to tell you. You can maybe try to make a phone call to the courthouse. Okay, when I meet with Shell, I'll do that. Okay, so take care of that because otherwise they'll put a warrant out for you. Yeah, I don't want that. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Can't give this man a ride. Please, 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 please do not make me catch you again. Yeah, yeah, Jason was like, damn, he was ready for that fucking yeah. that little yeah. stay the night. <laughs> he was ready to stay the night. Shit. <laughs> okay, I, I love you guys, man. Uh, I wish I hadn't been on the wrong side with you. All right, Kenneth. Listen, go get yourself some help. You're always polite, Kenneth. What's that? You're always polite. Thank you. Okay, see you later. You're free to go. Have a good day. Man, at least I let him go, though. He about to have a Since warrant because his ass ain't misdemeanor about to citations in the month of April, Kenneth pled guilty to one count of possession of paraphernalia and one count trespassing and was sentenced to no time in jail and ordered to pay about $400 in court fees. Then, in August of 2021, Kenneth was arrested on felony possession of cocaine where he was sentenced to one day in jail after pleading guilty. Well, at least guilty, he dropped the, the baking soda. <laughs> in this incident, once again, trying Kenneth to think voluntarily light. handed the officer his crack. Now, if you've made it this far and you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing. That's so as I crazy, raw bro. Police content like this video. Well, I, I wish, I wish Kenneth the best. You know, we, I, I wish Kenneth the best. You know what I'm saying? He's had. It looks like he's had a rough, rough life, and uh, yeah, I wish him the best. But that shit is wild, bro. He, you just <laughs> here, officer. Take this crack from me. I'm done. <laughs> All right, <laughs> that shit is crazy. But anyways, man. Shout out to you guys. I think we might have to just do a, uh, we might have to do an extra live, do some some scary videos maybe tomorrow. Um, you know what I'm saying? It was just real fun. I just, I, I couldn't stop doing the, the police ones. I'm sorry. I really enjoy these ones. They're fun. They're funny. I like talking shit. <laughs> just laughing. But uh, yeah, I shout out, shout out to everybody out there that came and hung out with us tonight. It was a good live. Shout out to everybody, all the members. Um, you know, everybody showed up and turned out and you know what I'm saying? And, and it was a good time. So I appreciate it. Um, Subscribe, hit that bell notification. Think about joining. Like I said, you know, three different options. You got two ninety nine option, the four ninety nine option, and the nine ninety nine option. So you could be a high member, a really high member, or the highest member. Okay, and then the free ninety nine options. Obviously, just subscribing and bell notification. Okay, but uh, yeah, all that works. I love y'all. Man, uh, y'all have a good night. It's, it's about to be Monday tomorrow. School is about to be starting back up. If if y'all kids haven't already went back to school already, so uh, yeah, man, strap your boots on. It's time. It's school year. It's 2022 and 2023 school year. <sighs> it's that time again. I love y'all. All right, man. Peace. <laughs>